Hey, welcome back to the channel. So I often get asked about my business model and how exactly does it work? What exactly do I sell? What do I do? And how exactly do I make money online? And it's actually pretty minimal. There are three pillars of my business that each have their own place and build upon each other. And that's what I wanna share with you today is my minimalist online business model that pulls in multiple six figures in profit per year. And I'll break down each of these pillars and how it works and the place it has in my business. Now, before we begin, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon. Doing that lets me know that you're enjoying the content, you're getting value out of it. It also helps to show it to other people who can benefit from it as well. So if you wanna be helpful, and if you also wanna show me that you're enjoying this stuff and motivate me to keep creating these videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of my future videos. So that said, let's hop into these three pillars of my minimalist online business model right now. The first pillar is done for you services or DFY for short. And these are services where I do all the work for the client. So over the years since 2017, uh, Growth Response, which is my services company, I've had multiple different services that I've offered, but most of them have been around email marketing and copywriting. And I used to charge monthly retainer fees or one-time investments for the service for setup. Nowadays, I no longer charge retainers. What I do is I work with seven to eight figure companies who have multiple different offers. Typically they're in the info product or the coaching space and I help them enroll people into their multiple different offers. So let's say they have a, a ebook or a physical book that they're selling and they have a coaching program or a mastermind in the back of that. What I do is I go into their book buyer list and I help them to enroll people into their coaching and their mastermind program or their course whatever offers that they have on the higher ticket end. And I get paid only out of the sales and the revenue that I generate, typically around 30% of whatever I bring in. So that's the current done for you service that I have is this 100% performance model. If you go to growthresponse.io, you'll see exactly how that service works. And done for you services are what I recommend most people start with, especially if they're new to online business and they don't wanna burn a lot of cash or invest a lot of money upfront to get started. And there's a few reasons for that. Number one is it's almost 100% profit, right? So when you go out and you don't spend money on ads, you go out and get a client, whatever they're paying you is typically, it's almost 100% profit. Maybe you use a few automation tools that cost you know 50 bucks a month or 100 bucks a month, but other than your time and your labor, it's 100% profit in your pocket, whatever you're getting paid. Number two is this is how you get your first few case studies, which are super important in building your business. So if you're able to work closely with a client and you're working one-on-one -on -one with them and you're doing a lot of the work for them, there's a lot higher chance of success versus just like selling a course and then hoping they do the work on their own. And number three is this will probably be your highest ticket offer because you're doing all the work for the client. And it's also the easiest to sell because if you're reaching out to the right clients, what they don't have enough of is time. They have more money than time and they wanna hire someone to do the work for them. So it's gonna be the highest ticket offer that you're gonna sell and it's gonna be one of the easiest ones to sell because you're doing all the work. Now for me, I don't personally have to sell done for you services. I could go strictly into courses or coaching, but I still do it because it keeps me sharp and I'm a practitioner at heart. So I wanna be in the trenches and learning new things and testing it out with clients directly. And I enjoy working with clients directly. So done for you services will probably always be one of the pillars of my business. So the second pillar is done with you coaching and consulting or DWY for short. Now done with you means we work on something together. So I'm providing you with coaching and consulting and strategy, but you're the one going out and implementing on that strategy. So we're still working together, but unlike done for you services, I am not going in and implementing and executing for you. I'm just giving you the strategy and the blueprint and you're going out and you're executing on that strategy. So my current done with you offers are one-on-one -on -one coaching or consulting. And then I also have small group coaching programs like my email side hustle program. Now done with you offers are amazing. I love them. I love the leverage it gives you, but you should only be moving into them once you have results, you have case studies, you have some reputation built up and you have a system that works. And once you have all those things, done with you is a perfect thing to add to your business because it gives you leverage and it makes fulfillment a lot easier since you're not going out and putting in labor and hours to do the work for the client. But again, in order for you to move successfully into done with you offers or done with you coaching and consulting, you need to have a system that works. And that's why pillar number one, done for you services is so important because it helps you to develop that system where you can then take to a done with you offer. So for example, if I didn't spend years doing email marketing and copy copywriting services for other clients and, and getting clients on my own and having a system for doing that, 
I wouldn't have been able to create my email side hustle program. I wouldn't have been able to create a one-on-one -on -one coaching and consulting program or a roadmap that I can help clients through on a one-on-one -on -one basis. And I wouldn't have the knowledge to create a solid done with you program because I wouldn't have a system that was working yet. And all the best coaches and consultants that I know personally that are making seven, eight figures, they all came from the done for you services side and they only moved to done with you once they found a system and a way of doing things that worked and was proven with their own business and their own done for you services. So I thought that's just super important to, to make clear. You need to have a system that works before you go out and sell coaching or one-on-one, -on -one, whatever it is. But that's number two. Pillar number two of my business is done with you coaching and consulting. The third pillar is do it yourself or DIY products. And these are digital products where a customer buys the product and there's no support or there's no coaching or anything else from me. They buy the product, they have everything they need to execute and to get a result with that product. So all I'm really doing here is I am creating a product that solves a specific problem for a specific person and I put it up on a sales page or a shopping cart, whatever it is. When someone buys it, that's it. There's no support from me, there's no coaching. They go through the product, they can get a result with it. Now I love DIY products. Everybody loves DIY products because it's passive income. Right? There's nothing that I have to do after it's sold or created. I don't have to do anything personally. I don't have to get on the phone. I don't have to talk to people. I don't have to so provide any coaching or support other than maybe some billing questions or some technical support issues. But other than that, it's completely hands off. And I'm basically getting paid for a piece of my brain on autopilot. But similar to what I said for done with you coaching and consulting, you need to have a system or a way of doing things first that works. And this is a big problem that I see in the online course and the digital product space is people think they can jump right into online business and make passive income selling these automated courses before they even have any skills or reputation or case studies or results built up or a system that works. And that's an easy way to fail quickly is to not know your stuff and to try to sell products to people before you have any skills built up. And if you do that, you are going to fail. It's not gonna work out because you have no substance behind your products. So you need to know your stuff before you create any do-it-yourself products. Now, what you also need to make do-it-yourself products work is an audience. So you might notice that I create a lot of content for my email list. I have a YouTube channel, obviously. I have a Twitter account, a LinkedIn account. These are my audiences or my Facebook group as well. Now, without an audience, it's, I don't wanna say it's impossible, but it's very, very difficult to sell digital products, enough digital products to make a full-time income if you don't have an audience. So you need to have an audience built up. And again, going back to pillars number one and two, the way that you build up an audience is to develop skills and to document your journey, document your results, and build up a reputation from your results. So my recommendation for DIY products is not to jump straight into it. It's to start with pillar number one, done for you services. You can make 100% profit or close to 100% profit doing high ticket sales and doing services for other clients and other businesses and then creating done with you coaching and consulting and digital products down the line once you have a system that works and once you have a way of doing things. So a few quick examples of my own DIY products are my seven day super fast sales email challenge, my six figure drop servicing ebook and my info product empire ebook. These are all DIY products that require no effort on my part on delivery or support or coaching. As soon as I created it, I could sell it 24 seven, 365 without any involvement from me maybe answering a few you know, customer support tickets with billing, but that's about it. But those are a few examples of my DIY products and that is pillar number three of my business, do it yourself or DIY products. So those are the three pillars of my minimalist online business that brings in multiple six figures in profit per year. It all starts with pillar number one, which is done for you services, where I work directly with clients, help them get amazing results and I also have to sharpen my skills by working closely with those clients. Pillar number two is done with you coaching and consulting where I provide the strategy and the blueprint, but the client goes out and executes and implements on that strategy on their own. And it ends with pillar number three, which is DIY or do it yourself products, which is basically my expertise and in, in my brain packaged and productized that requires no extra effort for me to sell and deliver. Now, if you want to run a similar business model to mine, I recommend that progression. If you're starting from scratch, right? Done for you services first, then use that to parlay into done with you once you have a system that works. And then once you want to build even more leverage and you have an audience built up, you can start creating D DIY or do it yourself products that require very little involvement from you. So that's the progression done for you, done with you, then do it yourself. Also, if you wanna learn about how I use email in each of these three pillars, go to emailrainmaker.com. That's gonna take you to my free Facebook group and my email list where you can join 
for free, and I talk more about that. So again, email rainmaker.com. That's going to take you straight there. You can join both my email list and my Facebook group for free. Alrighty, that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.